All right, I'm so happy you guys are here. It's always good to see you. And this product, I'm so, it's cool that this product, I knew that, that, that Ross was going to mention something that was in this. Yeah. Yeah, cool. Okay, so you, why don't you guys so um, talk about, so Real Wellness is a, an incredible er herbal company of all sorts. Um, you can say more about it, but this is a new product that you guys have come out with, and you can talk about any other things also that you want right, to. Okay. Yeah, I, I said to Linnea, I'm like, I'm like um, or I said to Ricky, I'm like, how do you feel about being Linnea's husband here at uh, Rama? <laughs> Ricky's like, that's fine. I mean, I, I, I can deal with it. <laughs> yeah. Um, um, okay, so go ahead. Linda. Hello. Um, I took notes, too, to make sure I cover everything while we're up here. Um, so, oh, do you want me we to We do take have that? this if you want to hold okay, it. Okay. Linnea's husband. Yeah. Um, Linnea's husband. Linnea's husband. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, yeah, so I'm Linnea Myron, and uh, this is my husband, Ricky Williams. <laughs> And this is our team over here clapping for us. Yeah. Thank you, Real Wellness team. Um, and uh, and yeah, so we we met several years ago, and uh, he has been a um, a longtime student of uh, well, he's a healer, and he's been a longtime student of uh, herbalism, um, all of it, Western, Eastern, Ayurvedic, and he's currently getting his uh, master's in TCM at Emperor's College, which is a very renowned school for, uh, for medicine in, in Santa Monica up the road. Um, so when we met several years ago, um, I fell in love with herbs the same time I was falling in love with him. And he taught me a lot about the personalities of the different herbs uh, in ways that I, you know, wish we'd been taught when we were younger and in school. And these are these are things we just uh, weren't taught. Um, so so we started on our own. I was still a corporate lawyer at the time, and he liberated me from that life. And we started making uh, herbal remedies for our friends and our family. And we were seeing quick results. And uh, out of that, we launched Real Wellness uh, two years ago. So um, our mission is a healer in every household. And we do that by providing accessible plant medicine formulas to those who are interested in taking healing into their own hands. And right now, everyone's in their households. Yeah. And they need something to do, and they need something to do uh, besides just watch Netflix. And uh, we've been watching what's been going on in the news, and we're very concerned by um, the behaviors of, of what we're seeing, how people are choosing to respond to what's going on. Um, <laughs> yeah. It's concerning. Well, it it um, is. You know, and, and for us, you know, it's being proactive, you know, and... Uh, you know, it's been amazing listening to, to all of the, the great advice and, and ideas and perspectives. Yeah. And so, you know, we're happy that we can share what we do with, with people. And we, you know, there's an 800-year-old formula um, called Jade Windscreen. Um, and it's an amazing formula. It's three herbs. Um, and, you know, the, the main herb or the, the chief herb is uh, Astra, Astralagus, um, and it's a chi tonic, you know? Um, and so it really helps build the, what in Chinese medicine we call the Wei Qi, which is the energy of protection, you know? Uh, Western medicine calls it the immune system. But actually when we, you know, we, the Chinese point of view is we get energy from two main sources. Uh, the first is the air we breathe, you know? The, so the lungs become extremely important. And also in Chinese medicine, the lungs are considered the sensitive organ because they're exposed to the environment. And so when we get a, a cold or we get a flu, uh, in Chinese medicine, we refer to this as a wind invasion, You know, usually wind heat yeah. or wind cold. Yeah. And so this formula, Jade Wind Screen, it's like a screen, it, it protects your body from the wind invasion. You know, I, I like learning Chinese medicine because a lot of it is taught through, through stories. You know, and, and if you go, way back in, in China um, to the Han Dynasty, you know, they believed that disease was caused by if you did something um, mean to someone, their ancestors would, would curse you, mm -hmm. you know? 
And the next dynasty, the, the medicine theory advanced to where it wasn't always the ancestors, it could have been ghost, right? And today that language still, it still exists in, in Chinese medicine. We talk about evils attacking us, you know, coming in on the wind. And if you think about the way that people are responding to this, this is what it feels like. You know, there's some ghost or something out there that's, that's gonna come and, and attack us. And so Huang Qi, um, the, the chief herb here, it, you know, it, it's interesting. I, I've been playing with this formula and taking it and, and, you know, herbs are powerful. And so before I, I go into the details, I wanna give a warning. Anyone that has um, hypertension or high blood pressure, um, to start off with the lower dosage and, and build up. Because what Hong, Huang Qi does is it, it raises the Yang Qi. You know, it's the defensive Qi. And the way they talk about the, the defensive Qi in Chinese medicine is they, they, they say it's like soldiers walking around the fort, guarding the fort, you know? And really, when you take this herb, you feel energized, you know? Uh, and a correlate to this uh, that I've, I've come in contact with myself is, and one of my favorite quotes is, Life doesn't happen to you, it happens for you. And, and that's everything, right? Mm -hmm. And so thinking about all of us are having these different responses to, to what's going on right now and to ask the question, you know, what, what can I do with this, right? And so, you know, messing around with this formula, taking Huang Chi, I just got a burst of energy. And I started making plans. I started thinking about what, what am I gonna do, being proactive, right? This young energy going, going forward. And it, it fits, you know? It, thinking about, you know, where we're headed, right? And, and using this time to reflect uh, and, and get clear where we're going, okay? And so the, the chief is the Huang Qi, right? It, it builds up our, our, our energy, okay? And another thing that I noticed is it's very much for the, the Wei Qi, the defensive protection is very much connected to our aura, you know? Mm. This idea of something trying to invade us, but if we're strong, it bounces off, right? And during typical flu season, right? Some people get sick, some people don't, right? And so one of the, the signs of your Wei Qi being weak is spontaneous sweating, okay? One of the functions of the lungs is it is it controls the opening and closing of our pores. And so if the, pore, if the lung chi isn't strong enough, the pores will stay open and we'll find ourselves sweating for no reason, okay? So this would be an indication that, that this formula would be very helpful. Mm. It's one of the number one indications for it is, is sweating. And also um, fatigue, right? This also is a sign that our, our chi is low. And an interesting one that's connected to the, to the toilet paper craze is loose stools, you know? <laughs> is that, if your stools are loose, you need more toilet paper. And so another- That's why. That's why. Yeah. <laughs> I've been asking, why is everybody buying toilet paper? I don't understand. Well, and uh, another connection <laughs> and here like to our- Freud to response. Our, <laughs> another connection to our chi here is, is worry, right? Worry yeah. affects the spleen. You know, and if we're worrying and our mind's going, it's, it's not good for our, our immune system, right? Uh, and and I, I heard earlier this idea of forgiveness. Um, the lungs, uh, in Chinese medicine, lungs are connected to grief, you know, and, and the lungs are about letting go. So as, as we have downtime, it's a good time to practice forgiveness and to think, you know, what's weighing me down? What can I let go of, right? Um, from a from a really a Taoist Chinese me medical perspective, these are ways that we can help build our, our defensive chi. And also forgiving our, ourselves for how much uh, of Netflix we're gonna be watching. Yes. I feel like yeah. that's gonna be like, for the type A among us, it's like, forgive yourself now, pre-forgive yourself yeah. for. Well, I think as long as you like fit in one of, uh, one of the animal planets or animal documentaries, you, you, don't feel as, you don't feel as guilty. Yeah, yeah, if you learn something, <laughs> exactly. it's, yeah, exactly. it's not, not true detective season one. Exactly. <laughs> Although you learn a lot, I don't know about that. You, have you guys watched it? It's really good. Yes. Yeah. Okay, and so Huang Chi, the, the next herb in the formula um, is, what we got? Do oh, Baiju, Attractylodes, another Chi tonic. Um, it's more specifically for digestion, and it's very good for, for water metabolism. So again, if we have dampness, it shows up as loose stools, um, it shows up as, as bloating, um, mm. and so Baiju helps, to, helps our digestion. 
And it also helps uh, control the pores, right? So this idea of stop sweating it helps, because uh, when we sweat, right, we lose, we're losing chi, we're losing energy. Yeah. Um, and the third herb is, uh, it's called feng feng, or silar root. And what it means is um, wind protector, you know? And, and so the way we treat a, a flu or a cold, an exterior attack in Chinese medicine is through diaphoretics, sweating, right? Open the pores, get the pathogen out. Um, and feng feng is, is nice because it, it will expel a pathogen, but it does it in a gentle way so it doesn't deplete us, right? And so th this, these three herbs really are what the formula are, are, is, is built for, um, building up our immunity for, for times like this. Uh, and we added a little bit of licorice. It's a chi tonic, so again, it, it'll help boost our energy. But, but you know, in probably 70% of Chinese formulas, you'll see licorice at the bottom, and they mm -hmm. say it because it, it harmonizes. It's another way to say it, it helps it. Makes everything taste good. Taste yeah. better, so you'll, actually, so you'll actually drink it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, it's a, and it's a chi booster, so it's perfect for, the, for this formula. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and so, you know, um, again, the warning is if you have hypertension or high blood pressure, you know, go slow with the huang chi and build up. And, uh, and just in general, a lot of people who haven't used Chinese herbs, they can be a little strong at first, and so, and so start slow. And, you know, we wanted to offer this um, to people in, in times like this. You know, because it's a wonderful, it's a wonderful formula, but really the idea of there's something that I can do, you know. Yeah. Yeah. I think this, this feeling of feeling helpless is, is just... It's not good for it's it's not good for our chi. It's not good for us. Yeah. Um, yeah, we've made it similar to like a blue apron, like a meal kit uh, type of product, right? To his point of of uh, the consumer at home does the final thing to actually make the medicine before they consume it. And I found when we do that in our house, I have uh, a immense sense of satisfaction that not only am I feeling better, but I've I've uh, actually used my own hands to do it, um, and. And that's what we want to make for people, you know, is that, that in, if we put all of these in a tea bag together, you wouldn't get to see uh, the magic individual personalities of these herbs. They smell different, they taste different, they look different. And like Ricky said, they each have a personality, you know, like the feng feng that he was mentioning, we think of it like the bouncer uh, or a, a security guard outside of your door, right? So a pathogen comes out and it pushes him away. And the attractor loads is is a defensive energy. It sort of pulls down, you know, it shuts all the doors, it shuts all the windows, and it protects while the bouncer's pushing everything away. And then you have those other two, the licorice and the astragalus, that are sort of charging up your battery while those other two are are protecting you. Um, and I and I love licorice too. It's not in this, but. This is why we didn't call it jade windscreen, because we took jade windscreen that, that Dr. Ross mentioned earlier, and then we added the, uh, the licorice, so we call it the protective shield, because it really, I've been on it now for a while, and I've never felt better. I, I, I go out into the world with confidence. I, I feel as if I have a, a, a shield around me, mm. um, and it's a great feeling to have uh, in times like this when um, you know, we want to strengthen ourselves to be able to help ourselves and each other right now. And I see a lot of very tired people, a lot of very low energy people. Um, and, and we feel that we have something to offer people that can be uh, mailed right to their doorstep, right? So you're home and, and you can do this and you can learn about herbs at the same time. Yeah. So the, cool. Yeah. The other thing is that, um, talking about thieves essential oil, you know, um, a good practice here, uh, and it's something I got from from one of my uh, one of my instructors at school. Is if you take thieves oil and you put a couple drops on a couple of uh, acupuncture points, mm. right, to build the 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 lung chi, the wei chi. The first is lung one, or um, lung one or two. And if if you fill in your shoulder right here, there's your collarbone, and right underneath your collarbone in the corner, there's a soft spot. Okay. That's, that's lung two, and if you go down about an inch, that's lung one, and so to rub a little oil right there on both sides, and, and also the, what we call the source point or a powerful point on the lung channel is right here, you know, at the crease of your wrist. If you bend your wrist, you know, there's this little pocket right there, and you rub a little oil right there. Um, and the suggestion is do it three days in a row, three days off, three days in a row. Um, and this is, you know, it's interesting about you know Taoism in, in Chinese medicine, it's it's about finding correspondences. It's about finding things that that work for you. 
You know, the, what I love about Chinese medicine is it doesn't separate the body from, from the soul and from consciousness. And, you know, you keep them together, it really boosts our, our natural immunity. Beautiful. Yeah. Really beautiful. Thank you guys for everything that you're doing. And, you know, I, don't, I haven't told you specifically, Ricky, I've told Linnea that um, I don't know which, which product is my mom vaporizing. Which one did you, you guys give her? Yeah, yeah. Um, the Serenity. Yeah. The Serenity formula. My mom's quarantined, you know, vaporizing <laughs> and, and, and yelling at Shubha Preet about her Netflix. And it's all because of you, Ricky. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> Um, but no, it's really helping our Parkinson's. Yeah. It really now. is. Yeah, it really is. And and I know it's helping a lot of people, like true medicinal, people who really need medicinal uh, marijuana and CBD products. Yeah. So you guys are really the top of the pop. So. Yeah. Well, I find just, just the idea of taking something natural and using it to bring your body back into balance in and of itself is a healing idea. Yeah. 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 Thank you for everything you're doing, and so good to see you, and and bless you guys. And so yes. this is available. Say your website. Yeah. So our our website is realwellnessherbal.com, um, and we're offering a 20% discount on it. Rama 20 is the discount code if you purchase it here. We have some uh, in the studio and online. It's a, it's 20% off itself for. $42 for a 14-day supply. It's $3 a day. It's cheaper than your Starbucks, and it gives you uh, 14 grams of herbs. This is a this is an average tea bag we took from, um, what was this, Medicinal Tea Company? Traditional Medicinals. Uh, most, most medicinal tea bags have about two to three grams of herbs mm, in them. Mm -hmm. This is two to three grams. Ours yields every day 14 grams. It's five times the size of a, a standard tea bag that you would buy in a store. And we provide you with 14 days of it. It yields a little below three cups. You sip it throughout the day and you just keep the shield going. Um, but that's realwellness.com. And on Instagram, we're also Real Wellness Herbal. On, on there as well. Yeah, so, so you know, formulas, in, it's funny, I was in, in Taiwan uh, last year, and it was strange going into a, a pharmacy, and there were no pharmaceuticals, you know, it was just, it was yeah. just herbs. Yeah. Um, and so the, the, form, the formulas traditionally are in a pharmaceutical grade, but since, you know, we're all yogis here, um, it's, it's a lower dosage than the pharmaceutical dosage, but over two weeks, it, it gently builds your, builds your immune system. Beautiful. And we've made some uh, for the for the people that are here in the studio. Uh, there's there's some out in the um, gift shop if you want to taste it to see if you if you like it and you can really get a feel for it when you when you drink it. Yeah, and I had a couple pounds of a reishi at, at the house, and so I added some reishi to the to the batch that I made out there. And it's, just for you guys. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thank so, you. It's a more expensive herb. Yeah. yeah. So please help. So we made it for you guys for Thank showing you. up here. Thank you. Um, and uh, also, uh, Sarah from Vitalist made some electro, electro, um, what did she call it? Electrolyte, sorry. Um, I'm thinking electrolyte, electrolyte lemonade, which is like my favorite drink for the past 20 years. And I could, I mean, I really could have an IV of it. Um, and you made some and brought, us, brought it over for us, which we really appreciate. And then I was just gonna tell people how to make it at home. Yeah, yeah. Because it's really important. Um, and the blender is such a good friend. And then just one tip outside of electrolyte lemonade, um, raw apple cider vinegar with baking soda and a little water just four times a day. It's like a fourth of a teaspoon with a cap of the vinegar and a little bit of water. Shooting this sort of helps the um, hydrochloric acid in your stomach. And baking soda or sodium bicarbonate is a byproduct of um, pancreatic function. So when you take this, it actually sort of helps work against mold, fungus, and yeast in your system and sort of can boost your immune system in itself. That's great. That's, so great. that's a quick at-home tip yeah. that we can easily yeah. do when everyone can afford. Yeah. Five yeah. bucks. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's great. And then um, electrolyte lemonade, it, so I'm not going to give you the portions because it's my top secret, but um, you basically need a couple of lemons, a couple of apples, and the lemon you want to leave a little bit of the skin on and the apples, you get the core out and the seeds. 
you put that in your blender, and you can use fresh turmeric or you can use powdered turmeric, put some sea salt in. And we recommend using olive oil because it sort of soothes and lubricates the cells. And, and I use honey, and if you prefer not to have honey in your drink, you can use something else, but honey is a delivery mechanism, antimicrobial, antifungal, antibacterial, and a beauty food all the way around. Um, you can put that in, and that acts like a delivery system for the rest of the drink, and then filtered water. And you blend this up, and you have electrolyte lemonade, and don't forget the sea salt, so the sea salt adds to the electrolyte. And um, lemons are a huge source of potassium, which we don't think about mm -hmm. often. Mm -hmm. And um, uh, you get 139% of vitamin C with one lemon. So um, it's a superior drink at this time. You blend it up, you store it in your refrigerator, and it's water that's absorbable into your system. So it's great for hydration. We have a few samples, only like 10, but um, so you're welcome to try you. it. And yeah. um, you can make this at home, and I, and I, I bless you in this process. So. Yeah, but it's never as good as yours. It's just, it's messed up. Cause, blend you know, it long. Know. Like, blend the thing. <laughs> I'm serious, okay. though. Satna. Um, thank you so much. And thank you, everyone, for joining us. Thank you out there on Rama TV. Um, this is our last time together uh, in um, person for a little while. But we're going to be live streaming like um, like a C-SPAN um, from Rama Venice. They're gonna, we're going to, all the ins and the outs, you know. Uh, we're going to be we're going to be doing all sorts of fun stuff and we'll be kind of revealing our schedule every day and um, uh, all sorts of cool recitations and prosperity meditations and global meditations and equinox will be doing you know all day long things um, to support your activation in these very wild times but there's some major miracles and mysticism happening and all of our prayers out to you and to everyone here thank you for being here with us and our community community is so amazing and it's growing and we love you so Satnam thank you so much for listening to another episode of reality riffing these are conversations that I think are important with people who are doing great things in the world about subject matters that need to be discussed if you enjoyed the content the conversation please feel free to share with your people share with your friends and family rate the podcast below and also subscribe.